We're going hunting for some big boys today. We're going hunting for big boys. Take control of the bigger man. That's what Jiu-Jitsu is about, right? Florida kissing me. This is Pans 2024. It was time for the absolute. Um, we're going hunting for some big boys today. We're going hunting for big boys. You know, I, I just won my division. I only had three matches. The job is done already. I already won my division. Now this is just to, to push myself and to go against people who are heavier than me, who have the size advantage, you know, the strength advantage. I want to see if my, you know, my athleticism, my technique, my skill, my speed, cardio can you know, give those guys problems. Fucking dude, man. <laughs> He's big. When I shot that double leg, I was like, I went single, single to single to double. Once I got it, I knew. Once I landed, he was gonna try to throw me out. So it was good. You came out. You said you're a gi man. You come out with a Yeah, I'm a gi guy. I'm not. I'm not a no gi guy. Like I said, my background is more no gi. But in like in in, in no gi, it's all about in my eyes. It's about creating space and taking space. And in Nogi, you don't have to worry about the lapel or guards or anything like that. So with uh, the Gi, you have to worry about the lapel, the lasso guard, squid guard, worm guard, and you have to have some type of form of curriculum. Right, and, and same thing with Nogi too, but in Gi, you just you have to have it, right? Like when I started going with Lucas, he put me in the worm guard, and I'm like, what the fuck is this? I've been training for 18 years, grappling, and he did that to me, and I was like, I have no idea what's going on. So, I just enjoy gi more than no gi. That's just 
And I like the point system where it's like, hey, I passed your girl, that's three points, give me my points. I'm out, that's four. You sweep me, you get two. Like, I like that point system. So, yeah, I'm a key boy. <laughs> They're all big. Everyone's fucking big. And if I would have got my leg over, I probably got the kill, but it's all good. I control the bigger man. That's what G2 is about, right? You know, watching him in like transition the MMA for the Jiu Jitsu, especially on the IBJJF, and watching him compete and understanding the rules, ask about the rules and everything, it's, it's amazing. He has a strong mindset, strong body, you know. We want to understand the rules, you know, respect here, every opponent here, and, you know, it's a beautiful opportunity. And I can't wait to see him again, next round, in five minutes, let's go. Pulls guard, he's got to do something. In my eyes, he's got to do something. But you know, he did a good job. My my teammate back home, that's his favorite choke. Is a cross collar choke. Pulls guard, he's like 195. I trade with him all the time. He does that choke all the time. So once he hit it with me, I was like, okay. Then before I felt it, then he transitions to the baseball choke, which was tight. Um, typically, when people do baseball chokes to me. I pretty, I pretty much go nasty MMA style with it. I put my knee on her face and start extending and just getting an ass with it. Extending and just taking it to him. But uh, got out of that one, on to the next one. So we'll see what we can do. Just fight, that's what I, that was the last try to do, just fight. <laughs> so what's gonna happen, it's gonna happen. Let's go, brother. Is, is it fine, okay? I didn't think I'd make it this far. Just one critical error. He was able to lock me down under guard. Just try to jump back and forth. He had a good job of controlling the lapel, my, my far sleeve. And then um, I wasn't able to get this hand back to start fighting his knees and to push his knees down and go around. Like he was doing a good job at extending me. Oh, thank you. Extending me. And his coaches were doing a good job about like, hey, like extend him, get a sweep, you're up, and you have one advantage, you know? So I just couldn't, he trapped the cheetah. I, I got snared and I couldn't, you know, navigate through his guard. Um, but hey, it's part of the game, baby. We'll be back next time. What weight class you? Heavyweight. Heavyweight? We usually do medium heavy. What the fuck? Now you feel great, don't what you? The <laughs> <fuck>? <laughs> Dude is awesome. Just to have an opportunity like that, you know, to coming in off an injury, taking a fight because a buddy passed away is the only reason I really competed today. And kind of iffy if I was going to do the open or not. And I didn't even see him until I signed up after the open. And just, you know, we met in the finals. It was a really good match. And I'm glad I took the opportunity and had that chance too.
But he did awesome, he did amazing. He fought against all tough guys for the bracket, for the division. And I'm proud of him. I'm very excited to see him again. God Pompey. damn it, can you believe he got yeah. me that triangle? Oh, no, I didn't. I've really never know. submitted yeah. him my whole entire life. Oh, not even next next time, next time. <laughs> <laughs> Demetrius. Demetrius. Are we going to see him at Worlds or what? What's next? We'll see. I, uh, there's some stuff that Viviano said I can't do, so I got to see what happens. So we'll see. Oh, thank you.